guys, how are you guys doing? Welcome back to yet again a brand new video on the M240i. For today's video, we have got a box in the passenger seat. And what is in that box, Michael? Thank you, future Michael. Inside the box is actually some juicy goodies from Auto ID. Look inside here. It looks like they packed me a bloody picnic, mate. There's a nice bread loaf in there. Inside here. <laughs> is. Ooh. I'm excited to see these. I'm excited. Of course. Of course. The first mod on a BM. I think we've already seen it. Oh my God, this is wrapped up nice. This is actually a carbon fire. Fire? <laughs> carbon fire. Why can't I speak fam? A carbon fiber mirror cap. Ah! Mate, look at the way that the flex the wind just yeet. And also other than that, we've actually got some sweeping dynamic indicators to make that mirror cap look absolutely fresh. And obviously, it's carbon to match with the carbon spoiler at the back right here. So right now we're actually heading to my friend EHB Performance to actually get these mirror caps fitted. These are gonna look mint. Right, so we've actually made it down and the Beamer is now in safe hands off. Do you want to introduce yourself? Hi everyone, I'm Harry from EHB Performance and today we'll be fitting some carbon mirror caps from Auto ID. Um, and big thank you to Michael for uh, letting me do this one. Come on. <laughs> Right then, so it is pretty interesting down at this unit. So what exactly do you do here? So we do anything from your performance side of bonifications to restorations, um, even like car storage and servicing. Um, so for instance, we've got a nice Porsche 928 down here. For this is absolutely full inspection, um, Just to get itself up and running again. So full service, make sure it's running um, well, sort out you know, your fuel lines, everything like that. From round to the S3 here where we've got everything from a full scorpion back system, um, four inch downpipe and a bigger turbo, upgraded into cooler air intake system. This well. is an absolute salvage. He took me so, out in this and oh my, the launch in this. Yeah. Disgusting. Disgusting. Actually disgusting. Look at this car guys, oh my days, this is absolutely saucy. Guys, if you want to see a video on this S3, let me know. It is actually a savage whip. He launched me in this car, oh my god, I felt sick. That was the most brutal launch I have ever felt in my life. And it was wet. All 430 brake, um, stage two tuned as well by us um, from a custom map now as well. Um, and then we've also got project cars, so down to your cars, so that's going to be a new little kind of workshop, fun toy. And you got this bag of shit here. Yeah, get this out. <laughs> <laughs> Right, should we get started on the mirrors? Yeah, let's get started on these bad boys. Yeah, boy. Harry then got down to stripping the mirrors, which he made look very, very easy. If I was doing them, this would have been me after 10 minutes of fighting to get the mirror off. <laughs> Installation, the car was ready to leave the workshop. 
So, all right then, guys, here is actually the mirrors all on the car. Oh, my, oh, my, that is actually filthy. I mean, honestly, literally, the wind just goes, watch. You get me, mush. And then, obviously, you've got the carbon backdrop, mate. Oh, my God, the silhouette in the back. Man's bringing Shakespeare out here, mate. Honestly, I'm really a big fan of those mirrors. I believe, though, it just needs a lot more carbon to tie it in because it's a bit weird right now on a basically two series just some random carbon competition wing mirrors it's just, it's just a bit weird you know but i mean lads when you actually hop in the car oh my I'm literally watch this bro okay i'm driving the fucking batmobile fam. i'm driving a batmobile why is there a pointy thing is that sonic the bloody hedgehog so a massive massive thank you to auto id for actually supplying these wing mirrors oh my god and ah, i really <laughs> I haven't even showed you the sweeping indicators. Hold on. So, of course, the sweeping indicators come separate, but uh, they're a lot more nice. The other ones uh, blinked. This one, if it fucking focuses, sweeps. Very, very nice. Wow. So, if you guys are interested in buying either the dynamic indicators, the carbon mirrors, or just checking out what they have on store, make sure to use my discount code, the other stuff, for money off your purchase let me know what you guys truthfully think of these i think they look absolute monstrosity the next thing we are going to do is we're actually heading down to coventry tomorrow to get another little little thing done before we go any further i would like to say a massive thank you to the sponsor of today's video adrian flux if you guys don't know who adrian flux is they are actually the company who insured this bmw if you guys didn't know no insurance companies wanted to insure me at all they didn't even want to speak to me because as a 22 year old getting insured on an m240r you can imagine it's not easy especially with plans to modify it this is actually where i gave a call to adrian flux and they were more than happy to beat my lowest quote that i got for this car adrian flux have actually specialized in covering modifications for 50 years and are an active part in the community so now because of them i can drive around in my dream car at 22 modify and be happy that I am covered on the road. If you guys are interested, click the link in the description and check and get a quote for Adrian Flux. They are out here insuring the uninsurable. A quote actually takes less than 10 minutes to do, so in no time, you'll be on the road, whipping your pride and joy, knowing you're covered. Right then, guys, it is currently 7 a.m. in the morning we are down in coventry today and i can't even lie guys i need a shit mm -hmm. <laughs> i'm literally about to pull up to this like this company right try and be really professional while i'm bursting for a shit and there's no toilets about like i might have to go here lads like i might actually have to go here that 20 chicken nugget snack box is looking really juicy right now but we are actually getting oh the rear windows tinted. We're actually just getting the rear windows tinted today for many, many reasons. Like, I mean, literally, we could play backseat twister in private now. And also the main reason is when people are behind you, literally, look how easy it is to see in there. Don't know if you can see in there right now, but through my eyes, I can see very clearly. So I want to be able to pit my nose in peace, fam. Come on, is that too much to ask for a guy? So anyway, we're actually heading down to a tinting company today. To actually get these tinted and it's going to look a lot more sleek i'm about two minutes away but i really need a poo so so all right then we've actually made it down to coventry in this beautiful unit it looks it looks like a dream here uh here is actually Adrian from Evil. Hello guys, yeah, I'm Adrian. So yeah, today we got this nice BMW. He got obviously privacy glass slightly from the factory, but today we want to make it more darker for more style and more privacy and more aggressive look. So keep watching the video. We'll show you for some parts of the process and enjoy. I hope you enjoy this process, yeah? So we actually start the process off by cleaning the outside of the glass. If you've never seen tinting, he's about to walk you through the whole process of it. And it's pretty interesting how easy he makes this look with all of his different techniques and everything. So, take the measurements. Position of 
in over the glass. So we trim that, trim away then some of the excess. So yeah, this is the shrinking process, uh, which is probably one of the difficult parts in this process. You need to understand the temperature. Uh, you need to understand how the film works. Now using a squeegee tool, we're gonna take all the water away. If I did this, I would, I'd have rage quit three times. We've, we've all seen me tinting and it never goes well. So seeing how easy he made that look, it's, it's mind blowing. We removed the liner, so actually the film got a liner on top. We wanna spray here. We wanna do this really quick. So we want to protect from getting contaminants on the film. Now this is where he actually cleans the inside window and then goes and transfers the film from the outside to the inside. Absolutely mad process to watch. Especially how easy he, he made it look. He's actually violating how easy he made it look. Look at that, that's 10 times better. Wow. I don't think I can see it at all. Yeah, so if people want to come down for their uh, windows, where can they find you? Or So you can find on all social media, Instagram, Facebook, TikTok as Elix. Just search Elix Window Tinting, Google, we're local based in Bedwood near Coventry, just five minutes to Corina. Uh, I also have uh, training courses as well for the people they want to learn how to do, uh, to start their own business in the window tinting industry. Yeah. yeah I, think I'm gonna have to, I think I'm gonna have to do that. <laughs> So then here is actually the tin on the rear of the car. That looks 1010. So clean. But a massive, massive thank you to Evix for doing the window tinting. He was really cool. The way he showed me how to do everything made it look really, really simple. And he actually does that academy, which we're gonna have to do a video on. I'm honestly gonna have to learn to do window tinting because if my YouTube channel ever dies, I could turn it into a window tinting business. But that looks 10. Fucking tin. Now that we got the tints though, it makes me want to tint the lights. I didn't want to tint them before, but I might actually have to. We're actually gonna head home from. He We're actually gonna head home now. Massive, massive thank you. Links are in the description. Make sure to mention that I sent you. But oh, it smells amazing in here now. It smells like baby lotion. Oh! So here is actually the window tin on the inside. You can tell there's not much of a difference and literally from the outside, <laughs> you can't see in at all. So once again, a massive thank you to Evix window tinting for actually doing them. Massive thank you to him for letting me film it in his awesome unit. But yeah, there we actually have the car guys in a beautiful little ending for the video. Uh, of course, we got the window tint on and these amazing carbon competition style mirrors fitted from auto id so big thank you to auto id ehb performance and evix window tinting for modding this car a little of course we're starting small 
But just wait, we're going to be opening up the noise of this car soon and all of the performance of this car very, very soon. You just got to be patient, you know? Got to trust me, guys. Come on, a little bit, please. Just a little bit. Oh, mate, this car just wants to be driven. Hold on, let me let me end the video while we're driving. I'm just going to take the car out. I mean, honestly, this car was just... This car was just staring me out, begging to be treated like a slut just now. <laughs> This will be an absolute devilish sausage. Oh my god! I don't know what you guys think about the noise and everything, but that is just absolutely juicy to me. Those little farts when you change gear. Ugh. But anyway guys, that is actually it from me. Huge, huge thank you for always supporting what I do, guys. The BMW is slowly going to get there. Slowly. Anyway, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Follow me on Instagram, add in the Scott other stuff. All of the companies are in the description for you guys to check out, along with the discount codes. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you in the faces.